the board for all of you. She's a great lady. We're so delighted we got to meet her. And uh, we were joking. She actually provided. Can I work on it? Yes. Sir. Well, it is a sad day. It's sad all over the world. She was a woman that was just extraordinary, Nigel. Just an extraordinary woman, a great woman. Who could be greater than what she's done? And she did it so long, so well, and never made mistakes, if you think about it, right? Just never made mistakes. She was an incredible person. And it's a very sad day. She was. My mother came from Stornoway, and she uh, loved anything to do with the Queen. She would watch if they had a ceremony, even the smallest of ceremonies. When uh, the Queen was on, my mother would be there watching. Uh, she was a tremendous fan. She was a tremendous fan indeed. Moments of silence at the New York Stock Exchange and the UN Security Council. U.S. flags ordered to half-staff until the Queen is laid to rest. President Biden and the First Lady among the many world leaders reflecting on her steadying presence while also remembering how she charmed us with her wit, moved us with her kindness, and generously shared with us her wisdom. In a complicated world, her steady grace and resolve brought comfort and strength to us all. She was one of my favorite people in the world, and I will miss her so. It is with great sadness that New Zealand wakes to the news of the passing of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. I know I speak for all New Zealanders in conveying our deepest sympathy to members of the royal family and condolences to King Charles III on behalf of the government and New Zealanders at this time of enormous loss. The last days of the Queen's life captures who she was in so many ways working to the very end on behalf of the people she loved. And that is why I'm sure that we will receive the news of her passing with both emotions of deep sadness, but also gratitude for a life that was utterly and completely devoted to the service of others. This is a time of deep sadness. Young or old, there is no doubt that a chapter is closing today. And with that, we share our thanks for an incredible woman who we were lucky enough to call our queen. Украинцы, украинки. З глибоким сумом дізнався про смерть її величності королеви Єлизавети II. Важка втрата для усієї Європи і для світу. Від імені усього українського народу висловлюю співчуття королівській родині, усій Великій Британії та країнам співдружності націй. Наші думки і молитви з вами.